arrested him because it's illegal to hurt someone's feelings in England. This is the new thing where they're arresting people. And we have the article up at Infowars.com. People know I don't get off into the whole, you know, bashing different religions and groups. I just stay out of it. But you know what? You've got to have the right, if you're the Chick-fil-A owner, to say, I think a marriage between a man and a woman, you shouldn't have Rahm Emanuel say, shut it down. You know, we're not going to let you operate in Chicago. I mean, that is very dangerous. Okay. I, yeah, go yeah, ahead. Yeah. That was like one of the biggest topics on my show is, and people were really, really in favor of what Rahm Emanuel was saying. I'm saying, listen to you. We, we left England because the government was tyrannical and was dictating to us. And here we are having a mayor say, you don't have a right to own a business because of your political point of view and your religious point of view. It, it, it's it's like insulting to the constitution. Have they heard of Nazi Germany? Because that's how the the discrimination started against certain groups was not letting them have businesses at first. Well, I mean, think about it. I mean, that that same city would be happy to confiscate your weapons, would be happy to take your pack lunches away from your children and give them government lunches, and would be happy to tell you if you don't believe with the same way as the mayor believes, then you're going to have to uh, go somewhere else to have a job because you won't get a license in that state. I mean, the thought is is that this person's a a conservative who but does not believe in same sex marriage. That's just his worldview. Okay for him, but that now bars him from owning a restaurant in the city because of his political and religious point of view. And if you disagree with that view, that's your right. Don't go there. But listen, it gets worse. They're now saying in England that uh, that if you criticize Islam, you'll be arrested, period. And now in congressional testimony yesterday, the video's up at Infowars.com, the deputy attorney general will not say that they won't arrest Americans that criticize Islam. Uh, it's a very spooky space where you're now worried that what you say could get you arrested or get you on some kind of list that gets you in trouble simply because you say, I don't believe in a law or I don't believe in the way the government's going or I'm not happy with the tax law or I think we should have more freedom of speech or I'm not pro-gay or I am pro-gay. That could get you in trouble with the government and quite frankly get a website shut down simply because your personal point of view is anti what a regular – Later likes. It's very scary. When the, set, when the First Amendment and the Second Amendment go away, uh, we're no longer the United States of America. And again, the model of political correctness that they have in Europe and England now, you say to somebody, you let your dad down, I hope you know that, because the guy had made it all about winning the gold medal for his dad. Well, I mean, you know, you let your dad down. That's a creepy thing to say. Right. You know, I'd say something like, hey, your dad's still proud of you looking down from heaven. You're in the arena. Great job. But if somebody wants to be a troll and a creep, you get arrested for that. That is serious authoritarianism. And now they're saying, because Paul Watson and his brother who write for me live there, and, and they say, if you criticize even an Islamic radical group, you'll be arrested now in England. I mean, this is just just so bizarre uh, and it is a very, 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 very scary thing. Now, the AP says UK police arrest man over Twitter insult. We just showed one saying they're investigating. They've now arrested. We'll be back with Dr. Corey Gold with a big announcement and a lot of key health news straight ahead. We'll delve more into fluoride as well, exactly from his research, what it does to your brain and the rest of your organs. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Don't forget, uh, you can find out more about the revolution against tyranny in health at InfoWarsTeam.com. All right, we are back live on this 31st day of July 2012. Dr. Cordy Gold is our guest. He is a dentist, a nutritionist, long bio, and one of the most successful developers of uh, nutritional products out there. You know him for... Things like pollen burst and products that I use and promote and that I, my whole office loves and my whole family loves. And you now almost everybody I know in Austin is, is, is using. You can find it all at InfoWarsTeam.com. Uh, and we've been covering a host of issues. I want to get more into these attacks on the First Amendment, the Chick-fil-A situation. Now people being arrested in England for Twitters that are just mildly insulting. Uh, like, hey, you, know, you let your dad down not getting a gold medal. You're arrested. No more free speech. We're going to get into all that. Major Harvard study published in Federal Government Journal confirms fluoride lowers IQs. Again, the magnitude of the fact we're being poisoned by design. Well, the body is able to heal itself. The globalists want to make you sick. I lost 40 pounds on this, and it's not even a weight loss product. 
And yes, I'm in for marshalling here. I only do this like once a month or something. But I do it with things I really, really believe in. Aaron lost 92 pounds. And the reason is the food has had the minerals taken out of it because of the fertilizers they use, the, the, the ground being played out, not being left fallow. It's basic farming rules, you know, that go back to Leviticus and before. We're not following any of that common sense. And so plants take two or three minerals to grow. We take a whole bunch, upwards of 90. And even mainline vitamins and stuff don't have all the 90 vitamins and minerals and trace elements. They'll have like 45 or 50 or 60. When you get the pollen burst, now Pollen Burst Plus, that's the announcement. When you get Beyond Tangy Tangerine, when you get the products at InfoWarsTeam.com, it's not advertised as weight loss, but you won't be as hungry. You'll have more energy. Because, and again, my only problem is I am not accustomed to taking it three or four times a day. Aaron's followed it totally and lost 92 pounds. We're about to do a whole promotion, rolling that out and, and, and going over it. But if you're a radio listener, go look at an Aaron Dykes video two years ago. Look at him now. In a year and a half, 92 pounds. Now, that said, drum roll, please. You're watching on PrisonPlanet.tv. I was just about to go live here in the segment. I went, I was already making myself one of these, as I do in the afternoon now, instead of you know, just drinking coffee all day. And I thought, wait, I'll just do it on air. Pollen Burst Plus, and we can show people watching on PrisonPlanet.tv, is featured on The Alex Jones Show. Because this all came about because I'm like, yeah, I like your, you know, kind of orange flavor, whatever it is. But I said, I would like, you know, something more berry tasting. And they're like, well, it's really funny you say that because we want to add more antioxidant to all the, you know, proprietary B vitamins and A vitamins and all the other stuff that just supercharges you. It is the best energy drink out there. And they sent me samples a few months ago saying, do you want to endorse this? And the answer is absolutely. Uh, uh, my children, uh, everybody, we're uh, running some audio through one of our computers. I, I tell you, these computers are getting crazier and crazier. That was a drum roll. Oh, they were getting the drum roll ready. I thought it was, I thought it was like an air raid siren. <laughs> Drum roll, please. Here it is, uh, the uh, Pollen Burst Plus. And yes, when you purchase it at InfoWarsTeam.com, your purchase helps us hire the six reporters we're getting, the six graphics and news layout people we're getting. We are not just going to sit here and be the number one alternative media outfit in the world, you know, with me pulling the whole train. We're going to go to the next level, and it takes funds to do that well. Uh, so... Again, we are fighting here. So when you purchase stuff at InfoWarsTeam.com, you get the best products, you get discounts, and you also support the transmission. We're not like the Rockefellers that take your money in government bailouts and then you know fund MSNBC. We're here saying, hey, these are products we like. Because I scoured out there looking for products that I really thought were the best and finally found them. Oh, man, let me tell you something. I love Pollen Burst Plus. Dr. Gold, you developed this. Uh, Corey, tell us, I know you, we still got the regular Pollen Burst at InfoWars team, but tell us about the Pollen Burst Plus. Well, it just happened to be great timing. We were, you'd mentioned to me how much you like Pollen Burst, and we were working on a new formulation of Pollen Burst, Pollen Burst that had even more in it than the original Pollen Burst. And we call it Pollen Burst Plus. Uh, it's called uh, the new Berry Blast. And it's actually a formulation that you tried actually before I even tried the flavor of it. So I know where I sit in the pecking order of things because you called me up telling me how much you liked it before I got my samples. And it's a berry flavored beverage. So it's got everything the original Pollen Burst had in it except we've added New Zealand black currant to it. So we've just supercharged the antioxidant property to it. And a lot of people are becoming aware of black currant. It's a superfood now. It's one of the super berries that's out there loaded in antioxidants. It's got a lot of natural vitamin C in it. It's got, uh, it's even got EFAs in it. It's got omega-6s in it. Uh, which is good for making prostaglandins and for decreasing inflammation. Uh, the vitamin C is obviously good for your, your heart health and your immunity as well. It produces natural energy. So when people take a product like Pollen Burst or Pollen Burst Plus, which is now your formulation, uh, your endorsed formulation, Right, we're, we're out there with it. This is a product that's endorsed by Alex, and it benefits the InfoWars, and I'm, I'm proud to be doing that. I'm proud to be working with that. And we wanted to make, we wanted to make something that was so superb that, I felt proud about it being connected with you and connected with your audience. And that's what we did with Pollen Burst Plus. So as everything the original version does have in it, it's got 
superoxide dismutase, which is a which is a wonderful, most powerful antioxidant you can possibly get. Uh, SOD is made by your body every single day. It's the antioxidant your body makes, and your body's used to it. So we're just boosting that amount, which also raises your glutathione levels. It's got ECGCs from green tea extract, another very powerful antioxidant. It's got pollen grains, which have all those micronutrients that you were just talking. Uh, we're losing Doctor. We're uh, we're losing Doctor Gold's Skype. Oh. Let's let's try to pause a moment or reconnect because that's becoming a bit unintelligible. Yeah, the point is is this is the best energy drink out there. I won't take energy drinks because give me headaches. I love coffee, but if I drink three or four cups, if I'm say staying up here till midnight working, I get burnt out. I get mean. Pollen burst, and I tried some of their other energy drinks too. The longevity puts out, and, and they're they're good, but not as good as Pollen burst. And so that's around here. That's what I drink. We've got the you know other ones. Rebounds good as well. But the point is, I really like Pollen Burst. Well, now I don't drink the other flavor. It still tastes great. I like the berry flavor. And you heard it. It it's uh, got uh, you know yours truly on the cover. It is an Infowars endorsed product. And I hope that all Infowarriors will go to InfowarsTeam.com and sign up for ten dollars to get discounts on the products or just buy the products right there at InfoWarsTeam.com. And again, other revolutionaries rob banks to fund themselves. We're not revolutionaries. We're restorationists. We want the republic back. We fund ourselves promoting things that we believe in, things that we use, things that we're proud to promote to you. So Pollen Burst Plus, uh, it's got so many great things in it from the pollen to the black currant to the vitamin B1, vitamin B3, B6, B12, uh, vitamin D3. Uh, it's got a whole bunch of stuff in it. You can see it there if you're watching at prisonplanet.tv. And it's an amazing energy drink and everybody I know gets hooked on it. Uh, Dr. Gold, what's the difference? Because I love the way coffee tastes, okay? Right. And I buy, you know, local Rudamaya coffee. Love it. It's from Mexico. But uh, take Starbucks coffee. I drink one of those. I'm 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 high as a kite for five hours, but then I get really grumpy and have a headache. And everybody I know is the same way. Right. Uh, but uh, so, so coffee does something to you. Uh, you know, root of my, I can drink four or five cups before I get a headache. Uh, be Starbucks one. But coffee's great though. I mean, I like coffee. It's got some health benefits. I've read about. I mean, you can tell me if I'm wrong. But I can drink if I need to two or three pollen bursts over the day, stay up till midnight. If I'm doing coast to coast AM, I've been up since 6 AM the day before, bam, pollen burst an hour before. I feel great, can go to bed at the end. I used to could not drink any amount of coffee to try to stay up and alert, and quite frankly, would turn to beer. For whatever reason, beer would, would have a stimulus effect for me when, when caffeine wouldn't anymore. What's different about pollen burst now that I don't need to drink beer if I'm on an overnight radio show to stay up? I can take a pollen burst. Uh, well, you see what happens when I get excited about pollen burst. I, I broke Skype. That's what happened. <laughs> that, that's what happened. That's how powerful this new product is. And and I, I'm, I'm by the way, I'm very proud to be working with the Infowars with this and supporting the Infowars with this product. And we wanted to make it the best one. Y you asked about you know coffee versus other things that help you with energy. This has some green tea in it. It's just a smaller amount. We get our energy from a combination of different things, things with antioxidants in them, like superfoods and ECGCs and all those other things that we put into this product. They do contribute to increasing energy, but through a different mechanism. So there is some green tea in it. It does have a little bit of endogenous caffeine in it, but it's not like drinking a, a Starbucks, like you said, coffee. And I'm a fan of coffee too, but you're right. It does have a very different effect on the body when you drink, drink a lot of caffeine and then you your body goes away from the caffeine. It's, a, it's a kind of a crashing situation, and this doesn't do that. This is very smooth, very easy. Yeah, but a lot of other energy drinks have that crash. This doesn't have right. the crash, no. and that's not just hype, folks. Try it out. The regular Pollen Burst, the Pollen Burst Plus at InfoWarsTeam.com, and specifically on the alcohol issue, I know it's classed as a uh, depressant, but why for myself does it have a stimulant effect? It all depends how much alcohol you have in your body because eventually as your body's trying to digest and, and eliminate the alcohol, your body sees alcohol as a toxin. So when it's going through that elimination phase, eventually your body does see it as a depressant. Small amounts can excite the body. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, I mean, I'm talking about, uh, you know, like a beer.